It's time now for your science buzz stories that are making a buzz in the world of science. And first up, there was a loud, unexpected boom in Salt Lake City this weekend. Check it out. Utah residents shared that video, capturing the loud boom they heard on their doorbell cam yesterday. It was not an earthquake or military related, but it was this. It was a meteor, also captured by Snow Basin Resort in Salt Lake City, which you can see in real time, and there it is in slow motion. The boom would have been from that meteor hitting our atmosphere and blowing up, or rather burning up. The explosion came just after the peak of the annual Perseid meteor shower, which was Friday night. OK, NASA says a giant red star is recovering from uh, recovering mass after literally it blew its top. Check it out. The illustration of the giant surface mass ejection that happened in 2019. Astronomers say this is something that has never been seen before. According to NASA, the colossal star Maine Beluga lost a substantial part of its visible Betelgeuse rather visible surface during the surface mass ejection and had been slowly dim for years. NASA says the star's outer layers may be though coming back to normal as it tries to rebuild itself. OK, and researchers say rainwater across the globe should be considered unsafe to drink because of the presence of what are forever known as forever chemicals. That's based on the U.S. Environmental Protection Standards for the levels of these thousands of chemicals that never fully break down. The study says there's likely no part of the world unaffected by the contamination as they continuously get cycled through the atmosphere with the water cycle. They've even been found in Antarctica, the Tibetan Plateau. These chemicals, known as PFASs, may be associated with a number of health risks, including cancer. Now, I found that study just incredibly interesting. Rainwater not safe to drink. Luckily, we have, of course, water treatment that takes a lot of that stuff out of our water, but <laughs> no rain in the forecast today.